The Battle of New Bern was fought on March 14, 1862, near the city of New Bern, North Carolina, as part of the Burnside Expedition of the American Civil War. And today, we are going to be recreating said battle. And what I will do is I will start with the order of battle really quick. Now, here we have the Confederate Cavalry, which is positioned just behind the line. And let's see. Right here we have the 33rd North Carolina. Here we have the 26th North Carolina, which is a unit in the game. So that's good. Here we have the 35th North Carolina. Oh, sorry, this is a militia. Next to them is the 35th North Carolina, followed by the 7th North Carolina, the 37th North Carolina, and the 27th North Carolina. Now, for the Union, we have the 25th Massachusetts, the 24th Massachusetts, 27th Massachusetts, 23rd Massachusetts, and the 10th Connecticut. And additionally, we have the 4th Rhode Island, the 8th Connecticut, the 5th Rhode Island, and the 11th Connecticut. Here, we have the 51st Pennsylvania in the rear, 21st Massachusetts, 51st New York, 48th Pennsylvania, and the 9th New Jersey. And without further, further ado, let us jump straight into the Battle of New Bern. soldier, Katie Brownell, supposedly carried the 5th Rhode Island's flag into battle.
Zone the charge. The Battle of New Bern was the baptism of fire for the 26th North Carolina. The nearby 33rd North Carolina suffered their greatest casualties with 28 wounded and 32 killed. Their flag was captured and 100 men were also taken prisoners. George Washington Whitman, Walt Whitman's brother, served in the 13th New York and was present at the battle. He would later write, We marched up under a terrible fire, formed line of battle, and at it we went. The enemy were posted in an almost impregnable position, but after three hours of hard fighting, during which time our boys had crept nearer and nearer to the enemy's works, the rebels ran and the day was ours. Our regiment suffered pretty bad. We had only about 651 men when we went into the fight and lost about 100 killed and wounded, among whom was some of our intimate friends.